They say what? You two, what it is, man? It's your boy Young. You already know I'm back with another video. If you're new to the channel, right now, bro. If you new to the channel, right now, man. This is what I need you to do. I need you to, to subscribe to the channel right now. I need you to press, go up there, boom, subscribe to the channel. Not only that, I need you to drop down below right now and tell your boy what up, man. So, let's start it over, man. If you're new to the channel, all I ask that you do is like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a comment down below and tell your boy what up. If you're old to the channel, man, you already know what it is, man. Golly, guys, I, I don't know what's going on, man, but I just keep falling in this place. And I'm just sitting right here in the truck. And I'm in the big Silverado 1500 right now. I stopped by the, the bank to uh, take you know some cash out of the ATM. And I just like, man, I ain't I ain't dropped all week, man. I, I just want to say that, you know, I apologize, man, for my inconsistency, man. But like I'm human. Like I always tell y'all, man, I'm just like you. I'm no different than the average person. I'm not average, but I'm just, I don't see myself as nothing but, you know, a hardworking citizen of the United States of America. Um, a guy that get out here and try to make a way for his his family and uh try to make something out of nothing man that's that's just what i am man so um this video right here is just to tell y'all who i was contacted by um y'all won't believe this man y'all won't believe this but i'm just tell y'all like i'm gonna we'll get to that but i'm gonna just tell you that you know last week i ain't even run last week guys uh i just i don't know if it's me losing my passion for trucking and I don't even think it's that. I just think it's that. It's just so much going on in the world, man, that you're dealing with. So much, man. Like, like people don't know to have. When I pick up this camera, like, and even though I'm raw and uncut, I'm authentic, is that some days I want to vlog and don't have the energy to vlog. Some days I want to put out a video and, and just... The content is not there. Um, wanting the channel to grow. Wanting to get to a certain point where, you know, this thing can really work for me. You know what I'm saying? Because I know what it is to get paid from YouTube. Like, I know what it is to get paid from YouTube. And it's, and it's great when you're getting paid from YouTube. But you get a certain number. You look at all these other YouTubers. Like, I'm running my own journey. But, I, you know, you talk to some of these other big YouTubers. And they really making a good living off YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I would love to wake up every day and this would be my job is to get out and vlog. Like, I would love, like, bro, come on, like, and you making thousands of dollars a month? Like, who wouldn't? Like, that's common sense, right? Like, I ain't even been to the barbershop, bro. Look at me. Like, I, I just been in a in a place, man, where, bro, you know what it means when you say your back is against the wall, man? Like, I don't think people understand that when you say your back is against the wall that's like you standing against the wall and everything is front in front of you just coming at you coming at you you know what i'm saying like like bro i've been dealing with so much bro like so much and i i, I fight i fight i fight through it like i understand that it ain't tough times on last i understand that like there's gonna be problems in life bro but when you're doing it by yourself bro and you have so much responsibility, man. Like I'm talking about so much responsibility. Like you get overwhelmed, man. And sometimes I just get overwhelmed when I tell y'all like I need a mental break, like, and I take a week. Like I really be needing that time, bro, because I feel like sometimes I'm just like, like my head be hurting. You know, you check your blood pressure, your blood pressure up, bro. It's like, and it's not because you're not healthy, because I'm very healthy. You know what I'm saying? I'm very healthy now. You know, I'm, I'm a very healthy person. Like, I'm athletic. Like, I played sports all my life. I never had surgeries. I never had anything go wrong. I always go get my, my physical. Like, I, like, I'm good. But at a point, y'all, my head just start hurting. Like, I just start having headaches. Things just start happening, man. You know? And it was one thing after another, one thing after another, bro. And y'all know he trucking. 
what's the money maker? The truck, right? So if stuff start, stuff start going wrong with your truck, you gotta worry about to fix that. If you down for weeks, if you down for time, in downtown while the truck getting fixed, you still got bills at the house. You still got your mortgage, you still got light bills, you still got your car note. Y'all know I got I got two two cars. You know, you still got insurance for your car. You still got a you still got if you got a truck note, your big truck, your work, your money maker. That's not making no money. You still gotta make that note. Like y'all feel me. I know a lot of people out there feel me. You know, because I sit back and I listen listen to other people talk. And I'm I I would be crazy to think that I'm the only one going through this, but I'm not afraid to let you know when I'm up and let you know when I'm down. Like I'm not afraid to tell you that. But right now is that right now is just it's messed up right now. You know, it's messed up, bro. And it's not even about trucking, it's just a passion for just just everything, bro. And I had somebody tell me though, like, like you just don't seem motivated right now, bro. You just don't and you're an uplifter. Like you you uplift people, you motivate pe people to be the better version of themselves. And I'm just like, bro, I know, like, but I just ain't been myself, man. I just ain't been myself. And I'm sharing this with y'all because I don't want y'all to think that life is all pieces and cream, bro. Like, I go through stuff, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm authentic, bro. Like, I'm going to tell you like it is, bro. Like, right now, I'm going through it, bro. And not nothing, like, I'm not saying, like, nothing bad. It's just that, I, just life, bro. Just life. Like, sometimes you just get tired of working. Like, you need a break. Like, you know what I mean? dealing with personal stuff like you dealing with like phases of life like just life man just life but i just know that all things are possible to he who believes and i i will always stick by that i, I that's a quote i read you know since i was a a little bitty boy a kid and i would never detour away from that quote all things are possible to he who all things are possible to he who believes, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I believe that, and I believe that everything will be all right, man. I know it, man. It's just, I just got to get back to my groove, man. Get back to when things good, man. You know, we go through these things in life. We go through hiccups in life. We go through things in life. Um, But that's enough of that. Y'all, guess who, guess who contact me, y'all? Guess who freaking contact me? Y'all won't believe this now. Y'all won't believe this. I got an email from JB Hunt, bro. JB freaking Hunt. I wish I had my other phone in here so I could show y'all. Matter of fact, I'm going to put it at the beginning of the video. JB freaking Hunt. Reach out to me and ask me would I like to come back. Now, like I always told y'all, in the beginning like jb hunt when i started with jb hunt jb hunt was good bro like i got over there i did my thing the first year two three years i got the man we were making money but when we went wrong is when things the economy went you know what i mean it's the way they went about it you know what i'm saying that that's what that's what that's when i lost all respect for you know jb hunt who i was working with over there in the motor because it ever came back in real life, hey y'all, like I see, I just want to let y'all know, man, it's rough right now. You know, y'all might want to find another gig. Y'all might want to do something else um, until things pick back up, man. If y'all leave, you know, the door is always open for you to come back. Like, you know what I mean? When things get better, y'all, you know, and, and it seemed like even though I quit, like I told them, like, you know, I just got to do what's best for me. And even though that's what they wanted us to do, they pushed us out. But, you know, months later, you come back to me, email me saying, hey, would you like to come back? Call us, you know what I mean, to discuss, you know, your area. My thing is, I don't feel like I would never go back to JB Hunt for the simple fact that great company, don't get me wrong, I did my thing while I was over there, but how y'all went about the IC, bro, y'all y'all ain't care about us as a, as a, as a whole, man. Y'all ain't care about our families at the time, man. Y'all ain't care about what we had going on. And all y'all had to do was, was, you know, let us know something like, hey, guys, like, do something for yourself because it's looking rough over here. It's bad. You know, we don't want to keep, like, y'all kept stringing us along, like, checking in at midday, 2 o'clock in the evening. We trying to work, trying to make, pin, penny pinch, make something, working all night. You know what I mean? I'm getting home at 12, 1 o'clock in the morning, you know, 
man, it was just rough, man. And that's that's the reason why I wouldn't entertain the situation, man, because of how they did, how they went about, how they went about it with ICs, bro. Like, I don't see myself, I don't see myself doing that. I don't see myself putting myself in that predicament no more, man. You know what I'm saying? It's it's great to make, you know, a couple thousand dollars a week. And be home every night, man. That was that was love, man. That was love, and I understand hard times that nothing good lasts forever. I understand that, but how y'all went about it with the eight ICs, man? Like people was people livelihood was at at at, at in shambles, bro. Real men in the world had to depend on their wife. You know what I mean to look out for them, man. Like you know what I'm saying? Like people got real life responsibility out here, and it's like they didn't care. You know about what we was facing, about what we was going on, and by all means, this ain't a a, a, a video to bash JB Hunt. Cause like I say, man, JB Hunt is a great company, bro. Like they was good to me while I was over there. It just the the departing part. It just when it got rough that it was no communication. It, the res, at least respect me enough as a, a small business owner to to communicate with me. There was no communication. And when I went to get that tablet and stuff out my truck, man, you know, and that guy in the office that somebody that worked there say, man, they know what they're doing. They trying to get y'all out of here. They don't, they want to get it down to 50 ICs. Like they, 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 they not giving y'all loads. They're making y'all check in at midday because they know that like, people livelihood, the average person got kids that every person you know would have to can't work like that so what they gonna do they gonna quit and that's what it did to us man you know what i'm saying like that's the stuff that started happening and for me bro like I, I i don't respect that i can't respect that man i can't and 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 for anybody that know that watched this video that was a i see in a motor like y'all know man that's i mean like like bro i was a hard worker i went to work every day bro i showed up every day i was willing to run those when they needed help, when they needed to get low certain places, I was willing to do extra things that I didn't even have to do. Like, I, I really, you know, did my thing over there. But I can't entertain the point of, like, going back over there, bro. Because, like, who's to say that won't happen again? You know what I'm saying? Who's to say that you go back over there, how you going to have work? What you going to do? Like, who's to say, like, you going to go back over there making a good revenue a week, man? Like, nah, man. And I tell you another thing, when you get on your own, bro, like now nah, I'm fully on my own. When you get on your own and you see the money, the type of money you can make, yeah, it's a lot of responsibility. As long as you got paid off equipment, like paid off equipment, and you can just book your loads and run your loads, you can make what, four, five thousand dollars a week and go home, thirty-five hundred dollars a week, three thousand, twenty-five hundred dollars a week. It depends on how you want to run. Like me, I can make me thirty-five hundred and go home. I'm good. Thirty-five. I can make me $3,500 a week and go home and be good. You know, so JB Hunt, you can keep your email. I don't see myself doubling back, bro. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Hey, 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 hey. You know, we ain't talking about that. I'm talking to my people now. But anyway, man, yeah, that's just, I just want to get on here and rant, man. Let y'all know. I know I ain't post all week, bro. It's just that, man. I just I'm going through it, bro. I'm 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 human, man. I'm human, dog, and I'm just trying to fight through it, man. I'm fighting through adversity. I'm fighting through trials and tribulation, man. I'm just trying to make it happen, dog. I'm just still trying to make it happen. I'm still trying to figure it out. You know, that's just what it is, man. So you got to respect that. At least I'm not getting on here telling you it's something is not. At least I'm getting on here, not getting on here trying to be something I'm not. I'm just authentically me myself you know what i'm saying what you see is what you get bro so when you see me out here throw your hands up at me man let me know it's gonna be all right when you see me out here man know that your boys out here just trying to make it happen man for real that's enough rambling that's enough talking to y'all i just want to y'all update and uh let y'all know who we out to and y'all already know we ain't going for it so if you're new to the channel all that shit you do is like comment and subscribe man drop a comment down below and tell you boy what's up if you're old to the channel y'all go and tell jb hunt ain't coming back we ain't doing that we're moving on to bigger and better man but appreciate the opportunity man this your boy young you already know i'm gone